Well, I just seen an interview of Earl Spence, Earl the Truth Spence, the guy that just beats on his opponent. Like, he just stopped guys that he's not supposed to stop, like Kel Brook, Lamont Peterson. Tough guys in the welterweight division. The guy that everybody is spreading the rumors now, Javante Davis said, um, stopped Jermel Charlo in sparring. Um, but that's just a rumor. Nobody really admitted to it. It's the same guy who also stopped. Same guy who also stopped Floyd Mayweather in sparring. Stopped Adrian Broner in sparring. Who else did he stop in sparring? He stopped a lot of guys in sparring. But um, it's the same guy Keith Thurman is ducking. But uh, it is what it is. But what Earl Spence said was unheard of. Well, kinda, because Deontay Wilder did the same thing. Fought a guy on steroids um, and still knocked him out. Earl Spence said he wouldn't mind fighting Canelo Alvarez even if he was on steroids. But if he was caught on steroids, he'll still fight him, but he'll have to get tested before the fight again so he doesn't pop dirty again. But he'll fight him even if he popped dirty before the fight. I was like, wow, that's crazy. Still fight a guy knowing that he was on steroids before. He said he don't mind, he would still fight him. Earl Spence, Deontay Wilder, Terrence Crawford. These few guys, these guys, man, these guys are dogs, man. They wanna fight. These guys love to fight. It don't matter what. They're guys cheating or not, they still wanna fight. These guys are no joke. Earl Spence saying he will fight Canelo Alvarez, who is 13 pounds bigger than him, even if he was on steroids, that's unheard of. By the way, people gotta realize Canelo Alvarez is not really that tall. Earl Spence might be a little bit taller than him, so Earl Spence might have the size, even if he move up 13 pounds. So, that fight could be closer than we think. A lot of people may favor Canelo Alvarez because he's fighting at 160, but, uh, Earl Spence can get up there and wait, and that would be a great fight. It would be a 50-50 fight. But if the fight didn't go the distance, um, if Earl Spence can take Canelo shots like Triple G, he will be able to stop Canelo Alvarez to the body. I feel Canelo Alvarez can really never get tested down there to the body. So um, Earl Spence is the best in the game for body work. So I will favor Earl Spence to stop Canelo to the body.